Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. Customer Groups in QuickBooks Desktop Pro 2022 and later let you group customers together by shared attributes. These shared customer attributes could be things like location or customer type, for example. After creating the customer groups, you can then perform related tasks for only the customers in the customer group. These tasks include sending email, statements, and payment reminders, for example. To create a customer group in QuickBooks Desktop Pro 2022 or later, select Lists, Manage Groups from the menu bar to open the Manage Groups window. To create a new customer group, click the Create Customer Group button in this window to open the Create Customer Group window. Type a name for the customer group into the Name field. To enter an optional group description, type it into the Description field. Then click the Next button at the bottom of the window to continue. In the next screen, to select the fields and values by which to define the members of the customer group, select a Customer Data field from the Field dropdown. Then select a Comparison Operator from the Operator dropdown. Then select the Comparison Value from the Value dropdown. Then click the Add button below the dropdown to add the Customer Group Member criteria to the Selected Fields list. To add more fields and values, repeat this process. To clear our criteria in this list, click the X button at its right end. Alternatively, to delete all criteria, click the Clear All link towards the upper right corner of this list. When finished, click the Next button to continue. Alternatively, to manually select customers to add to the group if they lack a shared field criteria, skip this entire page and simply click the Next button to continue. Then click Yes in the confirmation prompt that appears. If you do this, you'll then see a list of all your customers on the next page. Then check or uncheck the checkboxes to the left of the customer names to include or exclude them from the customer group. Then click the Finish button to create the customer group after you finish. If you selected fields by which to include customers in the customer group, then the last page shows the selected fields by which to include them in the Selected Fields section. You can click this section to expand and collapse it. The customers to include appear in the Customers list below. To automatically add new customers that match the field criteria you specified or remove customers that no longer match the field values specified, Ensure the Automatically Add New or Remove Existing Customers based on fields and values selected in this group checkbox is checked. To create the customer group based on the criteria specified, click the Finish button. Then click the OK button in the confirmation message box that appears. After you create a customer group in QuickBooks Desktop, the group then appears in the Manage Groups window. To edit a customer group in QuickBooks Desktop Pro, Click the Select drop-down under the Actions column for the group to edit, and select the Edit command. Then click Yes in the Confirmation message box. Make any changes in the Edit Customer Group window that opens. This window provides the same options as the Create Customer Group window. Then click the Finish button after making your editing changes. To delete a customer group in QuickBooks Desktop Pro, Click the Select drop-down under the Actions column for the group to delete, and select the Delete command. Then click Yes in the Confirmation message box. Then click OK in the Confirmation message window that appears. To email the customers in a customer group, click the Select drop-down under the Actions column for the group to email, and select the Email command. The Send Forms window then appears and shows the selected customers and their email addresses at the left side of the window. Ensure all the customers have valid email addresses. 
To exclude a customer from the email, uncheck the checkbox to the left of their name. Type the email's subject and body in the Subject and Body fields at the right side of the window. To send the emails when you are ready, click the Send Now button in the window. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.